What is up, guys? Joe Holland here. I'm gonna let you guys guess where I am by this big rock in the background over here. That's right. I am here at the famous Moosehead Lake. Largest lake, state of Maine. Absolutely gigantic. It's got just about every fish in it that you could ask for. And I'm here with a pretty good group of guys. I'm here with Wayne and Andrew from Sebago Bait and Sean and Chubbs from Jack Traps. So we got a pretty good group today. We're not really sure what we're fishing for. Wayne brought a shack out last night. So we're gonna fish somewhere near where his shack is. And we might be going for brookies. We might be going for toves. I'd probably want to go for brookies if I can. Look at these guys, they're coming out in the wheelers. Right here, there he is. There they are, they're ready to roll. Guys ready to roll? They're ready. Andrew rolling in. You lead the way. What? You gonna lead the way? All right, well, let's put the scratchers down. There's the scratcher. This is gonna be a little bit different video than most of my videos because we are gonna be fishing out of a luxury ice shack today. This thing is equipped with a microwave, a television, a stove, just about everything you can think of. I can't wait to try this thing out. It's probably one of the best ice shacks in all of Maine. This is your shack, Wayne? Yeah. Right. Oh man, that's gonna be tough fishing out of that today. This is the one with the oven? Where's the oven? <laughs> yeah, This is pretty ignorant. Does it have a bathroom? Uh, it's got a room for it. Okay guys, we're gonna try to set up a rock pile out here that comes up to like maybe seven, eight foot for brookies, salmon, maybe even tow the outer edges of it. And to find this thing, cause I've never fished here in my life right where we are. And we're not really set up too well for this, for today's fishing. We're just kind of just shotgunning it. But I'm gonna follow my Garmin out there, my map to try to find this hump. Oh, yeah. That's the hump we want to get to right here. And we're right there now, so this will follow me as we're going. So I'm going to try to put us right on that. Should put us right on top of it right there. 
that should put us on the top of that hump and you can see like the sharp drop off right ahead of us and to the right and down here to the left so those might be good areas for togue or salmon driving stuff up on top of this rock pile and i don't even mind setting it for a brookie you know those big brookies don't have to be ultra shallow where do you want to be right on that 12 foot so we'll keep kind of angle a little bit right, that yeah. right out between those two holes yeah probably fish that hole cool all right guys sean and i never have been here before our group decided to fish this general area so we're going to use the mapping to try to locate some prime spots for fishing so we're looking at the map and we're looking what are you looking for like the first top of that edge yeah where where it comes up in okay perfect so we'll where do you want to be like right here on this nice little rock up yep and so we're going to try to get out right on the edge of it in there at that like 11 12 feet 11 12 so you want to be like right there yeah right in there right there i'll, I'll bring you right to that those spot. are fish pictures right yeah those are fish <laughs> <laughs> there's two there we could we can go catch those two <laughs> let's get you right to that spot we were just looking with the two fish on it yeah. you can adjust it perfect you want to put it right here so look we're fishing brook trout look how far we're i know with the ice we're only going to have to have water so no sinkers on. So the trick to that I is check these traps pretty regularly. Usually I stick my hand in the water and do like a little, you know what I mean, and it'll send them right down. Does it? Most of the time. Spooks them. Yeah. So I usually down. pull. I usually pull them down with it. This guy's a little. Big. Yeah, I try. He's a little like, big to be real no sinker. I try doing like that number right there. Yeah. And that, that just attracted him. To it. <laughs> <laughs> that brought him right to the surface. Yeah, yeah. that worked awesome. How much water do you have out there on your last one? 24, nice. 24, 6 or something. And I don't get on the ice much, but I feel like those are some of the biggest pressure ridges I've seen in quite a while. Yeah, there was one monster. This one runs all the way across. Yeah, if, yeah. You, look if you get over like where we were yesterday. binoculars at that one over there, it's, it's gotta be eight feet tall. Is it really? It's huge. We should go ramp it. Yeah, oh yeah. Send it. Yeah. All right, Sean, you're up for your next one. This thing's awesome. There's much point to it, but see these two spots here? These are like little 25 foot holes. Yeah. Set right in the bottom of them. Oh, set a toad set? Pick a spot, we'll go yeah. to it. Let's go right in the middle of that one. Okay. Just to drop it on his head. Oh, there you go. That's no joke. Should be. Do you set for salmon or toad on this one? Oh, it's only like 15 feet of water though. And you just set it. Just set it. Put a shiner down. Nice. Got a good view of the mountain in the background too. Pop it right on his head? I think so. Set a shiner right to him. Down the bottom? Yeah. Wow, there's only like 15 feet. Ain't doing much though. You'd think a toad would be screaming at it. We're, what are we on for? Anything? No, not water. water. 19. He's just on a big open flat. No edge, no nothing. See this hump over here? Mm -hmm. I might go hit the edge of that. Pretty interesting terrain through here. I wonder if them are like big rocks, rock piles. What? These spots where it comes up like that. Probably. It's probably all rock. Oh, Joe, you got a fly too. Is that little 20 up? Yeah. I thought it was up. Over there? Yeah, yeah that's, a, that's a brookie set. All right, you better hurry up and catch this guy. <laughs> you ready for him, or you want me to go get that and then come back? How, how long are you going to be? Uh, let's see if he's around. Because i got a salmon, and I am spooled. It's got to be right there. I mean, come to think of it, you should have just set the hook. You knew he was there. Anything? Yeah, little one. Little one? Yeah. Fucking yellow bird. Oh, my God. That's an eater right there. Save that, baby. Woo! Big old yellow perch. What's the state record? <sighs> Two pounds, one ounce. Is All right, I gotta go catch a bro brookie. Uh, a salmon brookie. Uh, a salmon uh, You want it? Yeah. Going in the slide. Yeah, that's good eat. Thanks, buddy. Sure. That's the best eating fish in this lake.
All right, she's tripped, but she ain't rolling. Oh, just pulled it off. Dang it. It was right there. I pulled it out of its mouth. If it didn't get my bait, I'll try to catch it right here. Nope, there he is. Came back. Feeling pretty solid. Pretty good size. Good fighter. Big head shakes. Could be a decent fish, folks. Oh yeah, Togue. Togue up on the top of this flat. Decent fish. Pretty sure it was a Togue. It didn't have any bright colors like a Brookie. We're running some pretty light line on my Brookie sets. So we gotta play this guy out. Fighting pretty good. I didn't get a look on size. It's no small fry, but it's not, it's not giant. Right on the top of this eight foot hump, five foot hump. If I can get his head started, I got him. This one's a little tiny hook, so he hopefully he's got it pretty deep for the landing's sake. That's a decent fish, good fish. He's nothing huge. You're gonna see him in a second. A decent laker. Nice. Not bad, huh? Yeah. Nice one. Oh, he's just barely hooked with that little tiny hook. Yeah, he did. What is that guy doing in there? That's what I was thinking. There's only like five foot of water right here. I'm on that eight foot hump. I might need something. Got it. Got it. Got it. Not bad, huh? Nice. He gave me an awesome bite. Look at that pin smell he just spit out. That's not the one I used. Yeah. Great start that? to the day. Cool. Yeah. Anybody got a picture device? I might have one. But he's probably got a better one than me. I got a camera. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. There he is. First one on the ice for me. Not quite set up yet, but Togue. Look at the, uh, what do they call that? With a, there's a word for that overbite. Yeah, it's a wasp, I call yeah. it. But got some nice teeth on him. Wicked short snout, isn't he? Yeah. Nice looking fish. He looks healthy. All right, let's get him back. I just started throwing out rapid fire. Yeah, yeah, you'll get one. <laughs> nice. Oh, he was bleeding? Yeah, oh, yeah, where that hook got him. Cool. Anybody got any bait? They just pulled their shack. They're probably coming back for it. Right, yeah. What you got going on over here, fellas? Yeah. We're gonna make some breakfast burritos with a little moose breakfast sausage. You're talking my language, moose. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got going on here? Peppers, onions. Holy cow. Andrew's sandwich. We got some eggs going on with salsa here in a minute. We'll wrap them up. Maple moose. Maple Even if we don't fish good, fellas, we're gonna eat good, right? Don't starve. Sure. Did you grab any moose steak? Uh, Look straight down. Oh yeah, she's there. Uh, yeah. Oh, he's still there. There we go. Head shake. Head shake? Head shake. I think I nailed it. Whoa, Jumbo! <laughs> Holy cow! That is a big bird. Oh, that sucks. What do you mean? It's a good That's one though. That's second a big biggest, one. Second best eating fish in this lake right there. <laughs> Jumbo. Was your, was your weight mark in your... Yeah. We're going to get a perch feed of this. I hope so. That's, That's a good one. one. That's probably one of the bigger ones I've ever caught. 
That's eight awesome. striper. Eight stripes? Yeah. Well, a couple little V's it looks like, toward the top. Oh yeah, this side's got all sorts of V's. Nice one, dude. Thanks. This is a taster's choice. Nestle. Is that Nestle? Yeah. Nest Cafe. Oh yeah, it's, and it, it's the taster's choice, yeah. which is better than the person who has no taste. That's what you get at the Dollar Tree. There you go. Thank you, Wayne. Yep. And there's a spool right here. Beautiful. Sugar. What'd you call me? Sugar. <laughs> yeah. Andrew. <laughs> There's better ways to do that. Big time. I'm just glad I didn't take a sled. Your other flag's up too. Yeah, I just watched that one go on. Run your own trap over. Oh yeah. <laughs> he almost ran over a jack trap. You got another flag on, over yeah, there. Yeah, watch that one go up. You uh, you might have tweaked that. Ah, uh, just a tad. Yeah. <laughs> Your reel was up against the ice. Uh, I think that's why you got stripped. That sucks. Yeah. Alright. Off to the next one. <laughs> <laughs> Stop early. Uh, yeah, I know big time. <laughs> You gonna run it over again or are you going to reverse? Yeah, I'll run it over again. Why not? I might try to take this. I might try to get into this thing. I don't know if I can get this out or not. We got a big storm coming tomorrow, so if this shack doesn't come out today, it's probably not coming out. What do you think, Wayne? Should I get it? definitely come out I just don't know if I want to put the time in to get it out it's probably gonna take about three hours maybe more yeah I think I'm gonna go fishing instead <laughs> yeah. Andrew are you feeling as ambitious about this project as you were last night no not really <laughs> All right, guys, that's about as far as I got on this thing. I'm not gonna spend four or five hours to maybe get this thing out. And it's just not worth it. Don't leave your pop-ups on the ice. Yeah. This is what you don't do, ice fishing. Yeah, that makes everybody look bad too. Hopefully the people that left it are all right and they didn't have like an accident or an emergency, but a lot of times when that happens, friends can get stuff off the ice. So we have no idea why this is here, but it'd be nice to get it out, but we ain't getting it out today it'll have to warm up quite a bit <laughs> let's go catch some fish instead all right kind of slow going so far but i heard there was an extra couple moose breakfast burritos over here and these guys actually bring salsa too that's pretty impressive they really know what they're doing so i'm gonna i'm gonna throw a little salsa in that thing maybe i'll start on it first and probably drive that whole burrito right into me yeah, yeah, I'll definitely do that. He came flying in. Flying in on me. Nice. Nice. 
Look at that toe, guys. Nice. Dude, look how fat he is. Oh, yeah. So I was just jigging that trap, and he literally just fully on the side. I go, whoa, like that, he's already on. Nice. I think there was another one, too, after I caught him. Really? On the screen, yeah. Nice. All right, we're on the board. Yeah, I know. Oh, look at the smoke. Oh, look at them all. Yeah. Holy smokes. He's still got more in. I'll let him keep those. There he goes. See you later, fish. See you later, little guy. All right. Nice. Look at this. Nice. Look at the smelt they're eating. <laughs> All those pin smelts, they're tiny. Wow. That's why they're so, those toge are so fast in here. Like he came flying. I know, when you said something, it was like he's already on. Yeah, I saw him come in from the side and he was already on it. Cool, thanks for taping that. Yeah, no, that was fast. Holy crap. It only took like, oh, oh, another one, another one. Dude, another one, chasing me at the bottom, ready? Here he comes, here he comes. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh, stay on it, stay on it, stay on it. There's either one or two there. Oh, that looks like a good one. He looks decent, doesn't he? He's not huge, but I'm gonna drop it to bottom again, see if it incites him. I thought there was two there. Oh, here he is, here he is, see him? Yeah. If I can get him to rise, let him get close. Oh, he did not like that. Oh, come on, stay, keep coming. See him going down to the yeah. bottom left? Oh, he's coming back. Let him get close and then I'm gonna play keep away. Slowly reel. Dude. This is awesome. Eating the smell. Oh, oh. Eating the smell right out of the grater when they came out. <laughs> Got him. There you go. He's a little better than the last one. I bet you guys see a ton of fish in those nets. Oh, it's stupid. Yeah. Five pound rookies. You know Wilson Pond and Monmouth? 10 to 15 pound pike all the time. Yeah. Vern was talking about all the rounds. Oh, that's, that's a good one. one. He's not terrible. It's about like that one this morning. That would win our derby. What derby? This all right, there's a, oh. How big is this guy? About 18? Yeah, that's right. All right, guys, 18 incher. That one was pretty aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> Wants to go back home. Let's try that again. All right, guys, nice little 18 plus incher. This one's pretty fat. He was aggressive. Ate pretty good. Afternoon. The biggest. Got him. Nice. Little guy. The first year was the biggest one. This is not too bad. Dude, oh, dude, they're all like that. The first year. Ooh, Woo, that, that was bad. That was I close. That. You see that? That's how I got hooked my first day out. Oh, it hooked me, how but it ripped out. That's pretty. How long have you guys been here? Not today. Oh, just today. Yeah, we came up yesterday, dropped the jack off. Yeah. Look at that guy coming in. Got him! I'm seriously going to make a full mile track back go get my... <laughs> almost feel like jigging myself. Oh, good one. Come on, too. There you go. I should go back and get my stuff to tell the guys, hey, I'm going to come win the derby. <laughs> Hold on. I'll be right back. We had oh, a there, we there's had been a, a couple guy, bigger had, ones here. We had like a six, seven pounder on today on the jig rod. Oh, he no way. The hole. Who did? Uh, a guy with us. So his his stinger hook on, on his lure hit the hole as he's coming up. Oh, yeah. Another one, guys. <laughs> I can't hold these up for the camera. What were you saying, though? Pew! Last. Wayne, what's going on in here? It's hell in here. I'm trying to turn this thing down. <laughs> what's on TV? Anything good? No, I'm not watching TV. This TV, nothing good. Any more over there? No, they kind of died off once everybody drilled a bunch of holes. Did they die off over here? Yeah. Sean was my good luck charm. I had one after another coming in. He came over to me and I had one right after another. Uh, yeah. And he left and I went to hell. 
We got some hot dogs and beans over here. Yes, let's heat them up. Looks good. I don't even need them heated up. Really? Yeah, this is perfect. Here, here I get you a plate. That's quite a meal right there. There you go. Sit down. Thank you. Where should I sit? Right there. Right over there? Okay. I don't have the tray in there for it to spin right Oh, now. yeah. Okay. Oh, you got a fan and everything for cooking? Yeah. That's awesome. Wow. That's cool. Yeah. I like that. It has one in the fart closet, too. Does it? Fart closet. Oh, what's this? That's this. That's the heater down here. Oh, okay. Is yeah. that a propane heater? Yeah. It's like... Yeah. How was it sleeping out in this? Was oh, it really warm? warm? Yeah. That was like, it was 10 below zero out there. We were at like 68 degrees all night. Oh my oh gosh. My. He just put on night mode and it just, just you know. She's popping away. Yep. That's pretty awesome. That's like the same kind of oven and stuff. Look at this. My camp. They even do stuff like this. Say you have a, say you have a beer. And they calibrate it. Look, ready? <laughs> That's cool. So wait, can you show them with that? Yeah. You have a beer? Off the top. <laughs> and then catch magnets this in. Wow. Catch cap. This is the real deal. Catch cover, catch cap. Yeah, exactly. How's it looking? I think it looks good. I think it looks like a little burnt, maybe. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's good enough. I'll take it right outside if it's burnt. They probably didn't like being on and off. Huh? Yeah, it might have burnt, but that's all right. Yeah, it smells a little burnt. I think it's good, actually. Like it? Yeah, let's put it in a bowl. Did you hit the popcorn button first time? Yeah. Nice. We're eating popcorn. Popcorn on the leg. In front of Kenny O. <laughs> Wayne, that's pretty amazing. We got to do a shack tour at some point. Go over the whole shack. Oh, he's on you. He's on you. Flipped up. You had him. Oh, he hit you. God damn it. He hit you twice. You gotta be kidding me. No, he hit you twice. He didn't even look at Joe's. He just walked right over to the He hit the dude. Turned around. I just said that. He hit you, turned around, hit you again. That was funny. Oh yeah, real, real funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, I think I might start on pickled smelts next week. You gotta be kidding me! No. Did you maybe actually just, see my rod? Just yeah. Plaster on Facebook yeah, twice. Now and, no way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> these guys all saw it. You saw him get hit, right? That post with it. Oh, he turned. Up. Uh, is he looking at you? Hit it. Did he hit you? No. Oh, you got one below you. Below you. <laughs> They're coming in high and low on us. Brady, you got one. I don't like this rod. I feel like if I open the bale, it's just gonna make a Oh, oh you got one coming, you got one coming hot. Lift. Yeah, he's gonna bite. He bit. Yes, sir! <laughs> 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 nice! Oh, he got him off, dude! Oh. Right oh. at the hole. Heartbreak. <laughs> ah. Oh, Chubbs, that was your chance to get on my YouTube Dude. channel. <laughs> now you're going to make the blooper reel. <laughs> Dude, oh, I had him That smoke. thing was so big. No, it didn't Did feel you that see big. him? It didn't feel that big. Oh my God, he was like this. <laughs> I am a hero. Oh, two. Two coming in hot. He's, oh, he's going after you hard. Oh, come to mine. Bite it. He's gonna bite. He's Go gonna to bite. The one that's gonna keep you. Oh, yes, baby, he's got, got it. Got him. Get him in. Got him. Got him. Feels like a better one. It is a good one. He came flying in. Got him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice job. He's on the board. Chubbs is on the board. Got him. Do I gotta do a hole? Get in there. Yeah, get her, hold it right up to the camera. Yeah. Wipe the blood off first. We got a nice one here, folks. Yeah. <laughs> End of the day. Nice. Good job. Yeah. All right. Are you there? Yeah. Any size? Oh. 
<laughs> You're on the board. <laughs> you called it. <laughs> yeah. First pressure of the trip. Nice. You want it? No, it's too small. That wouldn't even make one nugget. Oh, you took them all day and choked that thing down. Is that Marenko still? Damn, has got it. Nice, you're on the board, buddy. Oh, there's something there. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's something there. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, that would oh, with hey, <laughs> Sonny, that does feel pretty good. <laughs> I <thought> he... <laughs> Any size? Uh, I don't know. It, oh, yeah. 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 Nice. Yeah. It's, it's probably like six inches. Got <laughs> a boy. Bad, bad. Mouth watering. <laughs> yeah. You salivated. Yeah, that's the, that's an A cusp nugget. Yeah, the old. Well, I don't know. It'll, it could be the same one. This one. I was gonna say. What's the separate? Oh, no. it's a Laker. It is a Laker. Yeah. Oh, oh no, it's a no. It's oh, a nice stuff. Yeah. Well, it's yeah. Cool. yeah. It looked like a Laker, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Um, How he does this, I don't know. Jeff, that it could be hey, ten inches deep. No, it's dude. He crawls inside him and <laughs> seriously, dude. Yeah, if I can, if I can get a hold. His of hands him. will be all bloody. He don't care. You want some stat? Wow. Dude, why is yeah, that? That was impressive. Just, just cuss tomorrow. Yeah. It wasn't oh. a very big thing, oh, but he kept you took on the ice. Yeah. There you go. Bigger than the last. Yeah, yeah. Looks like your buddies have a mess with that. Yes. So you caught over a hundred. Easy. Easy. Unbelievable. They're all about the same size. These guys are right where I left them last time, last night. I like, I don't know, eight hours ago. He was checking this trap. <laughs> same trap. He was resetting this trap. I was like, man, that's a long reset. <laughs> that's awesome. Good for you guys. Yeah. You had a great night. Yeah, man. Absolutely. I'm surprised there's not more people out here. I know. I heard. I Is it just you two? No, Aaron's in the shack. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I was expecting Aaron to be out here for sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, they, I heard some guys with sleds heading out this morning, but yeah. that's it. Let me show you a trick. Yeah. You, you guys ever use the rubber band trick? No. Oh, I got to show you. Do you, you want to try it on that one? Yeah. This will save you like a lot of time and energy. <laughs> right, yeah, because only, they only go so far, right? Yeah, yeah give them like, like cuffs and toes. Yeah. Like the like, first two seconds. You know what I mean? They don't mess around. Yeah. So once you get set, I peel off five yards, yeah. tops, rubber band them, and then they, they run five yards and that, they hit the rubber band and it goes like this, and it sets on them. And if they're over eight pounds, they'll break the rubber band, who cares? Right. You know, then you, then right. you gotta it get them. Matter, yeah. But anything smaller, you're only pulling in five yards each time, and then, like when it's cold, it saved my butt. Is that where you're gonna be? Yeah. Okay, so give them, like, pull out, oh, about like there. Yeah. So that's all. And then you just take your rubber band like this and you pass it through itself like that. Yep. And then you coil this back up to the rubber band. And then you wrap this rubber band once you get pretty tight just over your reel like that. Oh, okay. And then that fish is going to hit that rubber band. And that hook's going to set for you. So he's got this much room to eat. Right. Reel, it, reel it up, buddy. Stay yeah. Then, your point was. And then you have to go to your point. Yeah, just roll you, so it's tight. You were like, uh, you were up to like, yeah, reel until it's tight. And then when you're done, just break.